The Silk Stocking Murderer. I, I said murderer. Murder. That's correct. There we go. Ah, oh, Phelps. I was just discussing with Finbar here how well you were doing. Finbar? What the fuck? Isn't his Finbar? Yeah, my real name. And you can just forget all about it. <laughs> a poor Hispanic woman murdered near City Hall and left lying naked in an alleyway. Another naked woman, sir? Yes. We seem to have had quite a run of them since the Dahlia Fiends first struck. Phelps is politely trying to hint that he thinks the Mendez case is hokey. Well, young Phelps, you win some and you lose some in police work. You're happy with the Mueller case, sir? Over the moon, boys! The DA couldn't be more pleased with the evidence, the witness, and the lack of an alibi. Now, get out there and catch my other scene. Holy shit, he like fucking lost it. What if Don- What if he's the Dally killer? What if he's killing all these people? Dude, our captain's a fucking serial murderer, dude. Spoilers? I don't know. I- I literally don't. Maybe he is. Like, that could have- that could be a really good plot line. Alright, we're gonna go check out this case. Crime scene at 1 p.m. Detectives, they're ready to start the show. I'll take you through. See, Mr. Finbar here ate lunch. I didn't get to have lunch. I just got called into a diner. I had to fucking fly out. I didn't even get a piece of toast. It's ridiculous. The diner toast is fucking amazing. Brothers, Pinker. Cause of death is pretty apparent. We thought we'd best wait for you when you're ready. Strangulation. Ooh, there's flies. Ooh. The detail, though. Lacerations on the neck would indicate a great deal of force. Lacerations, so like... There's like blood spurting out of her neck. Holy shit. Still? This must have been fresh, dude. Holy. Another wedding Ugh. On the finger. No skin under the fingernails. Ugh. As the Spider-Man would say, I don't feel so good. Antonia. One years old. But why the library card? Did he want us to find it? Kiss the blood. Kiss the blood. B D. Why is it all pixelated? That's weird. Is it like the light coming in on her? That's kind of weird. Alright, well... This sucks. The Mueller case was solid. I'm not convinced about Mendez. The best way to get away with murder is to pin it on somebody else. I'll bet a month's salary this is a copycat. Strangled. Battered. Yeah, naked. yeah, yeah. We know the M.O. So does every jerk who kills his wife and girlfriend. Right, Pinker. Spoken to Brown, he still believes the Dahlia perp has medical experience. Four women, all murdered, all put on display, all with messages. Mueller had no message. Look, Phelps, this is getting us nowhere. Anything for us to go on, Mel? Head injuries from contact with road, bruising from a small man's shoe, further blunt force trauma to the occipital region at the base of the skull. Could have been fatal, but clear signs of strangulation would seem to rule it out. Lipstick appears to be a similar color to the other cases. I'll see if I can nail down a brand. Well, he, he's, he's pretty smart. I don't want to step in it. Ugh. If she took a blow to the head like the others, she was probably... Stocking? Is that, was that on her? Or That's fucking weird, dude. Oh, holy crap, hang on. B. What the heck? There's blood trail, dude. There's a freaking trail, dude. May as well follow the trail. Alright. It's a hat? Oh, that's her hat. Huh. Same as the library card. 
Aw, poor girl. Blood on the wall there. Oh, it keeps going! Did he, like... Does he have, like, a... Like, a like a bucket of it? And he just fucking dumps it wherever the fucking... Uh, like, holy shit. Just keeps going. On it goes. Uh, he agrees with me. There's something shining. Yeah. What the? Area for steam for you boys. Let's check it out. Thanks. It's a key. What face? Key number five. He's strung up like bait on a hook. I'm super confused. Wait, is there more? What? Holy crap! That's a card? That's got to be a code. Two, five, three. I think we gotta remember that. Remember, two, five, three. Hey guys, what you doing? Texas? Hey, how's it going? These people looking at a f look at li li looking at a blood trail, girl. Like, come on. Did they watch this dude? I got that stutter there. Yippee Kaye, bud. Let's get up here. more blood here. Does it want me to go, which, I think it wants me to go in here, right? Oh, there's another no. Jeez. Maldonado. By hand. Written by hand. Empty. Where is all of this meant to be taking us? Yeah, I don't know either. He clearly wants us to find these things. He left them for us. There you go, Phelps. You got a new M.O. Oh, well, the blood keeps going, dude. Getting more confident. That's another thingy on the ground. Some makeup. Enameled and gold plated. This was precious to her. Was it like makeup? I don't know. I don't use makeup. I'm a guy. I mean, I know some guys that use makeup, but. That's neither here nor there. Wow, this is crazy. This is the craziest case I've seen in like all like This is the craziest case I've ever seen. I hope it doesn't get crazier than this. He's leaving us wherever. Another key? Oh, it's the ring. From the finger and hung up here. What's the significance? Hmm, let me think. Eh, I don't know any proverbs. I apologize. Oh, there's the bucket. Oh, he's like a paintbrush? That's disgusting. Hang on. There's like a brand or something? Looks as though the killer was decorating with this. Is this like blood? This is her blood? Ugh. I love how he's like completely unfazed, dude. Son of a bitch wants her identified. Mrs. Antonia Maldonado, 712 North Hill Street, downtown. Oh, wow. How did he remember that? Oh, crud. Well, we gotta get back down now. Oh, look, we're back down. Amazing. How fantastic. Well, I guess we gotta go to her address now. Bye. Antonia's residence nine minutes later. So it only took us nine minutes to climb up that... No way. Real time nine minutes, but that and get there? Nah, no way, dude. This looks like a halfway oh, boarding house, yeah. Kind of look like a halfway house. Where you send, like, orphans. So it kind of reminds me of. 
I mean, you don't send orphans. Like, it's like an orphanage. Poor orphans. Can I help you? LAPD, ma'am. Detective Phelps and Galloway. Does Mrs. Maldonado live here? Yes, she does. I'm Mrs. Barbara Lapente, the owner of this boarding house. Is there a problem? I'm afraid so, ma'am. Do you mind if we come in? Is there somewhere we can discuss this? Of course. Follow me through to the parlor. Wipe your feet as you come in, detectives. It's this way. Not wiping you for shit. I'm my own man. Dead. Oh no. She can't be. I'm afraid she was murdered, ma'am. We need to take a look at her things. I can't believe it. A person seems so alive, and then they're gone. Antonia's room is upstairs, last door on the left. Thank you. We'll be back shortly. Uh, excuse us a moment, ma'am. We're gonna skip up to her apartment. Save a little bit of time. Oh my god, the place has that. been ransacked. Someone's turned the place over. Holy crap. There's her husband, and there's a charm the bracelet. bracelet. Wasn't among the crime scene evidence. Oh shit. Mrs. Maldonado. Further to previous correspondence. Docket okay, number. Attorney. What is it for, though? I don't understand the papers. It's like they're getting divorced or something? It didn't really say. I read the whole thing. Looks tossed. You know how I feel about Windows Phelps. Yeah, I know. Don't ruin your $30 suit. Wait, am I going out there? I just opened the window, dummy. So someone broke in using this thing instead of a crowbar. I wonder where it was taken from. Weird. Alright. Doesn't look like there's anything outside, is there? Nah, I don't think there is. What did he- How I feel about windows gets- I open the window and then he immediately walks out. Alright, let's get down there. We have some questions, ma'am, if you're up to it. Yes, detective. I'll do my best. Do you have any idea who might have wanted to hurt Mrs. Maldonado? That rat of her husband, Angel. She was serving him divorce papers. If I killed every wife to serve me papers, I'd be a mass murderer. Are you being flippant, young man? No, ma'am. Young man? <laughs> They're like the same age. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, she's telling the truth. What she's can mean. You tell us about Angel Maldonado. She married him when she was 17. He was cruel to her, very cruel. She was a good girl, little on the religious side, but a good girl. What time did Antonia go out yesterday? She left around nine. Do you know where she went? No, I, I have no idea. She was a good girl, but she didn't confide in me. She's straight up lying, dude. I can see it. We can't prove it, so I just doubt her. A nosy old hag like you knows everything about the people who live under her roof. Where did she go? I think she went to a bar. She's been drinking quite a lot lately. This bar have a name? El Dorado Bar. It's a Latino place on North Los Angeles Street. That's only a couple of blocks from where we found the body. <laughs> Shit. You've had a break-in? No. That can't be true. Yeah. It can be. with the truth, Mrs. Lepenti. What do you have to hide? I have no idea what you are talking about. Uh. 
I'm so confused. The window, like. <laughs> so Antonia lost her keys and used an iron bar to jimmy the back window. I heard a noise in the early hours of the morning. I thought it might be a raccoon at the milk bottles. It'd be very bad for business if this news got out. I have a reputation to protect. Bad for business, so like. I, I don't understand what a boarding house is. Is it like a temporary like? Like I don't I understand like boarding schools, but not like boarding houses. Antonia and her husband were estranged? Yes. She moved here after she separated from her husband two months ago. But Antonia still wore a wedding ring? She wore the wedding ring and a necklace. She always wore a religious necklace. That's about all of her jewelry. I mean, she's lying. Because we have the bracelet, duh. What about her bracelet? I don't know anything about a bracelet. Yeah, okay. Tell me more about the bracelet, lady. In her wedding photo, she's displaying a charm bracelet. That thing? She never wore it. He gave it to her. She always kept it in that wooden jewelry box. Thanks, ma'am. You've been very helpful. Pay a call to that husband of hers. Lock him up and throw away the key. Uh, we should lock you, you up, lady. Angel, as the finger's pointing right at I don't like her. Tad on the racy side, as she is. But that's all the time we have on Play Game Repeat. My name's Saf. Thank you for watching. And we're going to go to the Eldorado Bar in the next episode. Take it easy.